All right, all right, all right. What's going on, everyone? Happy Friday. Good Friday. Holiday weekend. Hope everyone has some uh, nice plans for Easter. Cheney, what's going on, buddy? How are you? Thanks for joining us tonight. We are doing 2024. 2024. I'm going to say 2023. 2024 tops big league quarter case break number two. Welcome. Welcome, welcome. I won teams tonight and last night. Don't remember if it's easier to pay all now and get refund or wait till the invoice. Uh, I did send you an invoice, Ben, with the reduced shipping. So here's the deal. I try to remember day to day who's in them. If I can remember that you were in the day before, I'll send you a reduced shipping invoice. If not, just pay it and I'll refund it. Um, regulars like you, Ben, I usually remember. So, and I'm pretty sure I sent you one that was reduced. So maybe uh, if you didn't get it yet or check your junk, if not, you can just pay it and I'll refund it either way. But uh, for the guys like you who are kind of regulars or pseudo regulars who I know are in a few days at least in the weekend, I try to remember to reduce it. But, you know. I'm 50, I'm beat up, I'm old, I'm diseased, you know, <laughs> so I can only remember so much. Anyway, um, either way, I mean, if, if it, I, I think, I'm pretty sure I sent one to you, but I, I could be wrong too. Like I said, I'm, I'm addled, I'm a little addled brain sometimes, so you never know. Anyway, so that question answered. So let's get to it. Uh, welcome, especially if you're new to the channel. Welcome. A bit about us. We've been around for over six years now. We break mostly baseball. We ship all cards from every break. We're very generous with the top loading. We ship as quickly as our little hands will move. If you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. We do free breaks. When we do them, we use our subscriber list from YouTube for the random. So if you want a chance to get into a future free break, hit the old subscribe button there. Uh, eBay continues to run their sweepstakes. There's no purchase necessary there. Go to any of our eBay listings. Look in the description at the very top. There's a link there. Click on that and follow what it says to do and you can win some free cards. And then finally, chefsportscards.com. Head on over there. We got a couple big league breaks up over there. We have a half case 10 boxer up there. I think there's seven teams left. Uh, we got a half blaster case 20 boxer up there that has maybe like 15 teams left. So uh, if you want to grab a spot over there, once they're full, we'll get those uh, broken too. So, all right. So chefsportscards.com, go check it out. Let's go over the teams. Uh, D-backs, Michael P, uh, Braves, Jay Bryant, Orioles, Kurt H, Red Sox, Sean P, Cubs, Ben A, White Sox, David J, Red, Sean P, Guardians, or Jacob W, Rockies, Michael P, Tigers, Marty W, Royals, Michael E, Astros, Umberto Q, uh, Angels, Daniel H, Dodgers, Keith E, Brewers, John T, and Twins, Chris F, Marlins, Michael P, Mets, Brandon D, Yankees, Joe R, A's, Michael P, Phillies, Zane W, Pirates, Benny T, Cardinals, Michael E, Padres, Robert H, Giants, Richard R, Mariners, Cody B, Rays, Anthony L, Rangers, Richard C, and Blue Jays, Michael P. <coughs> I... Let's open some cards. Uh, no blade. Uh, can't open cards without a blade. Where is it? Ah, behind me, of course. Chris, what's up, buddy? Thanks for joining us tonight. Big League Baseball. Well, let's see how tonight goes. Last night's was uh, pretty good. Our first one, so here we are on to our second one. We got some more all weekend, Saturday and Sunday. Like I said, we got those ones up over on the uh, on the old website. All right, let's see where we are here. Okay, Michael Harris. Oh, Michael Harris. He had such a day today. There's a De La Cruz good vibrations rookie, Christian Walker. Oh, the Phillies. The Phillies. The bullpen just was horrid today. Horrid. Made me cry. Opening day to be so bad. It was a good game. Wheeler looked great. They got the strider, got a couple runs, and then the bullpen came in, and the Braves have beat the hell out of them. <laughs> Come on, Jansen. Focus. There we go. 
It was not a successful fill in cease. Not a successful opening day for the Phillies. Hey, uh, oh, I don't know if John's here. I heard there was a brawl in the Mets game. Is that true or bench clearing or something? Jason Dominguez, rookie. Jordan to the moon. To the moon, Jordan. To the moon. Corbin Burns. Joe, what's up, buddy? I thought there was going to be a bench clearing in the Phillies game, to be honest. They were pitching in on that Braves so much. Like, and uh, Acuna got, took one, almost took one to the face, and he, like, threw his bat up. I thought he was going to, I thought they were going to rumble. There'd be some rumble tumble going on. Belly blue on the rare for the Cubbies. From a man, Ben. The $80 million man, Cody Bellinger. Hoskins and McNeil. Real Hoskins got into it? Why? What happened, Ben? I didn't see that. How did he hit him or what 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 was it? My wife told me, but I didn't I never got a chance to go back and watch it. Like I said, I was watching the Phillies game and doing cards from last night. And she was working, and she was like, I think there was a brawl in the Mets game. I was like, really? Uh, Ricky Henderson on the chain. Connor Henderson. Well, that's what I said. They they did. I, I heard that there was a, they, uh, they, they were cleared. The bench is cleared anyway. McNeil and, and Hoskins. How does that work? What, they get in a fight on the base pads or something? Luke and Baker, Aaron Judge, to the moon, to the moon, Ellis, to the moon. Andrew Abbott, rookie. You know, got pissy on how Hoskins slid, <laughs> slid into second. Yeah, you pulled a Chase Utley, did he? <laughs> Hoskins is like a sweetheart, man. <laughs> uh, mascot, mascot. I hate that. When they don't have a name for their mascot, it's just wrong. Oh, here's our mascot. His name is Mascot. Max Muncy. Yeah, rough slide. Breaking up a double play. He's, he's a former Philly, man. That's the way they do it here. <laughs> Marte rookie. We've, uh, uh, Henry Davis rookie. We've had more than a few uh, incidents in Philadelphia with the way people slide in the second. Uh... Funny. Well, that makes an impression on day one for uh, Hoskins for the Brewers. Good for him. Ooh, Bo Jackson to the moon. And Real Muto. Such a shame, too. I, I really, uh, De La Cruz rookie. I really feel bad for when starting pitchers, like today with uh, Wheeler. Wheeler pitched great. Freddie Freeman, you know, leaves the game up 2-0 in the 6th or 7th, whatever it was. You know, struck out a bunch, looked great, got out of a jam once or twice, did everything he's supposed to do as an opening day starter, and then the bench comes in and just absolutely blows it up. When you're walking runs in, you know that's a problem. It turned into like a little league game when the bullpen came in. <laughs> I was like, I've seen this before with my son when he was seven. Uh, Oakland mascot. <laughs> he made a crybaby gesture at him. Oh, God, I have to see that. There's no, my wife must not have known it was uh, Hoskins. She would have gone nuts. She loved him. She loves him. Raphael Rookie. Oh, there's uh, Juan Soto in his Yankees uniform. Springer, good vibrations. Kirby. Oh. Well, fun day for baseball. Fun day for baseball. We got Tennessee playing tonight. See if I get another drunken video from my son. <laughs> Texas to the moon. 
uh, Hassan Kim. I was texting with him earlier today. He was golfing. <laughs> and I was like, so what's the plan for the game tonight? He's like, back to the bar. <laughs> said, okay. That night, just to, for those of you who were here and saw the video, he ended up at some random girl's apartment that night to <laughs> become a big leaguer. And Freddie Freeman, he's a dog. What can you do? Kid is living in a, it's like the king of Knoxville down there. He's living his best life. Uh, Jeremy Pena, good vibrations. Touch. He came out of the training room, really? The best. Sports fights are so great. They really are. Yeah, what do we got here for the Pirates? David Bednar. On the autograph for the Buckos. Benny. There you go, buddy. That's why I love sports fights. Like baseball fights. The guys running in from the from the uh, bullpen, <laughs> like, like really, if I was in the bullpen, I'd be like, guys, are we really going to run all the way across? <laughs> Where hockey fights are the best when the goalies come skating up, you know, and they get, they're going like 40 miles an hour and they just plow into each other. <laughs> uh, Frank Thomas. And Verdugo. <laughs> he doesn't want to close your autograph card. Hey, man, you say what you will, but look at the checklist for uh, Big League. They got everybody on the checklist. J-Rod. That's why well, the first year it came out, people were like, nah, nobody wanted it. And I was like, I told people, I was like, I realize it's not, you know, what you usually do, but it's inexpensive, you know, you pick up a team for 10 bucks or whatever, you know? Uh, but I say, go look at the checklist and do the same. Now everybody's on it. I mean, there's autograph. Now I'm not saying they're easy to hit, but you can, uh, any star you can think of has an autographs in here. We've pulled some big ones out of big league, big league over the year. We pulled trout. We pulled, uh, to rookie Tatis, I remember, in Tatis's rookie year. Gotten some uh, good ones. Acuna with the cherries. And Yoshida. Yeah, I think most of them, a lot of them have to the moon autos. Again, not easy to hit, but there quite a few of them have autographs. Adolis Garcia. Yeah, we always do a couple cases of it every year. Uh Fred Bird. Ozzy Albies. Yeah, I um yeah, I was always kinda on the fence with opening day. I, I like the fact that it had the dates on it. That I did like, Bobby Way, good vibration, especially for the rookies. Like I always thought that was kind of cool. And uh on the the year of uh COVID when they started late, I always thought like, well, because that was the la I believe that was last year they did opening day. And it had the original opening day date on it, which didn't, so it kind of made them all short printed a little bit. But uh, I did like that, uh, Torkelson. But they never had enough. Like, it, it's funny with Big League, even though for what it is, they've added to it over the years. They've added more hits to it, more parallels, stuff like that. They needed more in opening day. But, I mean, that was always kind of a set collector set, you know. Uh, Griffey and the Riz. 
Nobody beats the Riz. And I had this Purdue game on. That kid is a monster for Purdue, man. He's huge. Papa. Papa looks like skinny in that picture. Uh, Cabrian Hayes. Uh, Mason Win to the moon, rookie. That's a kid right there. Him and uh, the other one, um, Victor Scott. Man, I'm going to be... I decided I'm going to start playing um, Fantasy, DraftKings baseball again. I used to play it and was pretty good. I actually won, won more than a few occasions in tournaments. But I haven't played much in the last few years. Dominguez, rookie. I'm a big leaguer. Mr. Matt. Um, he's one of those guys, man. He's going to steal a lot of bases, that kid. Team's going to be terrible, but hey, as long as he steals some bases, who cares? The steal in DraftKings is the best stat, points-wise. That most people don't think of. Because you get like five points for a steal. Evan Carter, rookie. Randy Johnson. The Riz. Nobody beats the Riz. He got hit. I saw that. Was that yesterday in that game he got hit? Uh, Christian Walker. To the moon. For Brian Hayes. I wonder how many rookie to the moons. Yesterday we got a million rookie ones. One uh, Soto good vibrations. Logan Webb. Did NC State win again tonight? Wow. Good for them. <laughs> Number two, Marquette. Junior Caminero, rookie. And the Fanatic, the best mascot in all of sports. And not just because I'm a Phillies fan or from Philadelphia. He just is. Oakland, Cleveland, stands are empty. Yeah, yeah. What, uh, oh, um, Bryce, what's up, buddy? How's your, how's your boy? Jeremy Pena. How's Emmett doing? I don't think Rob Robert's here. He was talking about the fact that they need to find a stadium. Uh, Volpe, good vibrations while the stadium in Vegas gets done. I guess for like a year or two. I was wondering if they had any, come to any decision on that. The Jeets. Uh, Heston Kirstadt to the moon, rookie. Spencer Steer. Shohei as a Dodger. Schwarber Blue for the Phils. For Zane. Schwaba. And Bernie Brewer. Nico.
Wow, that's good, buddy. Glad to hear it. Did they have any idea how long he'll be in the hospital? Uh, Hank Aaron? And Devin Williams. Or are they just kind of taking it day by day? Oh, for the Rangers. Look at this. Evan Carter, rookie auto. Hell yeah. He's got the Rangers. Richard. There you go, buddy. Nice hit. That's the way you do it. You play the guitar on the MTV. Bryce, without, you know, I don't want to air your laundry all over this how did this all come about is it i mean it sounded like it was it was an emergency thing did something happen or that is awesome congrats man nice hit Yamamoto rookie and a mascot for the White Sox, Christian Walker. Yeah. Well, let them know we're pulling for him, man. I, uh, Horrible. I, I mean, I couldn't even imagine as a father going through what you're going through. Uh, Orbit for the Astros. <clears throat> Dylan Cease. Uh, Freddie Freeman to the moon. And a Corbin Burns. Evan Carter, rookie. Jeremy Pena, good vibrations. Wow. You know, it's um, it's funny you say that. Um, a woman who I work with, now this wasn't the same as your situation. Um, but she kind of had the same thing and started having headaches. It's been a two hours, a series. Of, oh man. Um, well, I, I mean, they, you said they think it's a good prognosis, right? I mean, uh, kids are resilient man. that's the nice thing. It's amazing what kids can bounce back from. Uh, anyway, I worked with this woman, uh, this is about eight, nine years ago, Frank Thomas. And uh, she was having headaches all of a sudden. And I mean, one day just out, of, and I mean, they were here and there. She would bring it up. Oh, I have a migraine, this and that. She had left work a few times and this and that early. And I asked her, I said, did you see a doctor? Yeah, I saw a doctor and they think they're just migraines and they're trying to do it. I said, all right. And then one day we were at work, it was like five in the morning and she just like freaked out. She had this horrible headache to the point where I had to turn the lights off in the kitchen. Like, she was just like, I can't even explain it. I don't, I, I don't even know how to, ex I, like, she was freaking out, but at the same time in so much pain, like, she, she had, like, photophobia and all this, so I was, I was like, let me call an ambulance. She wouldn't let me call an ambulance, so I finally called her husband, and he came and got her, and he said, you got to take her to another doctor, something, you know, something's going on here, and they, he went to, he took her to the emergency room and they did a, I think a spinal tap, if I remember right, on her. And there was blood in her spinal tap. And it ended up, she had an aneurysm, a brain aneurysm. Uh, Jason Dominguez, good vibration rookie. And I guess it was leaking um, from what I, from the little bit I know of how, how it actually worked. But the thing was, like, she was actually really lucky. If this thing would have blown like they normally do, she would just, 
you know, falling over dead, you know, on the spot. But, and she ended up having to have all this. I mean, she was, she was out for like a year. It was crazy. But I mean, luckily they found it. I mean, she was a woman in her forties, young kids, this and that. I mean, it would have been devastating if, you know, she had died. But it was kind of along the same thing where she had some symptoms little by little for a while. And then one day it just went haywire. You know what I mean? And luckily they found what it was before the thing totally blew. Numbness in the legs, arm, peripheral vision, loss, blurriness, incoherent. Blood. Wow, that's crazy, dude. And it ended up being a tumor, you said, right? A, a brain tumor. Uh, Ripken. Well, like I said, man, the kids are resilient. Luckily, man, they it's amazing what kids can come back from, and prognosis is good. That's thank you, lucky stars, man. Trey Turner, good vibrations. Spencer Steer. It is amazing, though, how like. I think of times in my life, I, I've had a few, well, I have, I mean, most of you guys know that I have Parkinson's. I have a, it's early onset that I do. I have, it's, um, you know, neurological disorder, this and that, and blah, blah, blah. That's why my hands shake sometimes, and, you know, different things. But I've had a few thing, times in my life when I've gotten sick, you know what I mean? Like, and it's amazing how quickly things come on, you know, like. One time when I was young, like in my 20s, um, I got, uh, well, they thought I had meningitis, which was weird. It didn't, they never said it was. But my wife and I went out with some friends one night to a club. And in a matter of like two hours, I went from being totally fine to like, you know, on my deathbed. <laughs> you know, like just like, wow, what happened? De La Cruz rookie. And I was down for weeks from that. And it's like, and I was fine just a couple hours ago. What happened to me? You know, so it's pretty amazing how quickly things can come on and take it, take you over, you know? <laughs> oh, yeah, man. They, they definitely do. Yeah. Yeah, with my son when he broke his arm, that was amazing. I would be, you know, crippled for the rest of my life if that was me. <laughs> Uh, Andrew Abbott. When I was 16, this is a crazy story. I think I've told it before, but I got really sick when I was 16 and almost died in the hospital. Uh, Shane Bieber, a rare a blue for the Guardians. I had this infection that I, well, I had mono, which was, and it was funny because my one older sister, Shannon, she had mono when she was in high school. And it was really bad. She was out of school for months. Like, uh, Guardians is Jacob. Here you go, buddy. And um, De La Cruz, good vibrations, rookie. And Max Muncie. So anyway, I get diagnosed with mono. And my sister, who was in college at the time, she comes and sees me. is like, oh, you'll never be as sick as I was, blah, blah, blah. She's kind of like breaking my balls, you know. And then like a week later, I was in the hospital. <laughs> and somehow, I don't even know how, to be honest. I don't remember now. I had this infection that got in all the lymph nodes in one side of my neck. And I was hospitalized for like two months. And it almost killed me. Like, it was really bad. And my poor sister couldn't even come and see me in the hospital. She felt so bad after making fun of me. <laughs> like, oh, you'll never be as sick as I was. And like a week later, I was on my deathbed. <laughs> That was weird. That was really strange. They they thought I was a goner. I was now again. You have to remember this is uh, like nineteen eighty seven, I guess eighty six, eighty seven, somewhere around there. And they thought I was such a goner. They put me in like a private room on the geriatric floor. <laughs> like, I was like, oh man, there's no way they're sticking me in with other teenagers. <laughs> like this kid ain't gonna do it. Uh, slugger. He's one of my favorites. Slugger. Yandy Diaz. Uh, 
Uh, you're fine, Nick. You're fine, buddy. Don't even, don't even sweat it. Uh, De La Cruz. I don't, I check people's feedback and stuff, you know. Um, I don't just sell teams off. I, in fact, I hardly ever do it, to be honest with you. I almost never do it. Um, things happen all the time, you know. People fall asleep, whatever. As long as you have good feedback, you know, you're, I, I don't sell off people's teams. I don't do that. Now, if I get a guy who's got like zero or one feedback and stuff like that, then I will because I know they're just trying to screw me anyway. <laughs> you know, but no, you're good, dude. Don't even sweat it. Uh, Junior Caminero to the moon, rookie. Bryson Stott. You got it, buddy. Who do you like as fantasy? Oh, is that, was that you? Oh, man, I was going to show him again. I was going to think, I didn't know that was, for, it had no name on it. I, I put them up last night. Did you send these to me? Uh, these are awesome, dude. Thank you so much. I was looking, there was an address, and I was even going through the database trying to see if I could match the address, but I couldn't find it. Well, thank you, man. That is, that's awesome. Yeah, man, they're, they're great. I love them. I didn't want to take them out yet until I, Either found out who sent them, Verlander Rare, or uh, showed it for a few uh, for a few nights to make sure whoever got them for me, I had got to thank. Yeah, they ship with Amazon, but there was no like name or anything, and it just you know there was an address, but like I said, I was having trouble matching the address. Uh, Umberto on the Verlander and JD Martinez. So, well, thank you, man. That thing's awesome. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's awesome, man. That's so, thank you so much. I opened them because I got the package. And I was like, what is this? I thought something was getting sent back. <laughs> I was like, oh, God, the post office again. And then I realized it was Amazon. I opened it up. I was like, oh, man, these are awesome. So. Yes, we will be using the Tennessee dice for uh, for some randoms from now on. Austin Riley to the moon. Endeavors. It's funny. I shipped it. I I took a picture of them, sent them to my son. He was like, "Oh, those are awesome. Where'd you get them?" I said, "Somebody from the break sent them to me." Jason Dominguez. Evan Carter, good vibrations. Eloy. Uh, Nolan Ryan. Torkelson. Uh, Yamamoto rookie. Gunner. That's the first time we've seen that one. Lars Newtbar. Josh Jung. Uh, Zach Geloff, rookie to the moon. Bull Lake Snell. Oh, I know. Those top scrum boxes were killer last night. I was thinking about that all night. I couldn't... You, you couldn't have asked for better. I was, uh, I was sorting them today, and I was just like, this is, these were nuts. Big leaguer, Sammy Sosa, slamming Sammy. Uh, 
Yeah, it just happens that way sometimes, which is nice. Zay Gray, Gunner Good Vibrations, Riley Green. Of course, they were my last four boxes, too. I don't even know what cases they came from. Like they were they were literally like four random boxes from different cases that I had. Arenado. <clears throat> they kind of just got shuffled around until they were the last four on the shelf. <laughs> so, somehow they all came together perfectly. Clark. Mark Stroman. Uh, Jazz, Yuri Perez, uh, Francisco Alvarez to the moon, and Castellanos. All right, four boxes in. You know what time it is. Bonus, bo uh, bonus blaster box time before we do box number five. Let's see what we got in old blaster here. You know me. I get cases of blasters. I just got to give away all the time. <laughs> I can pretty much guarantee every break we do, there's going to be a bonus blaster box. <laughs> Plus, now that I'm not allowed to sell them on eBay, I have to, uh, you know, do breaks them. I have to get rid of them somehow. All right, let's see what the blaster gods bring us today. Uh, Dominic Canzone on the orange rookie. Screech. Yuri Perez. Uh, no problem, Ben. This is what we call the blaster break. The, the blaster break in the middle of the break. <laughs> the break in the break. <laughs> uh, a Rosarena. Stroman. Ryan Presley, orange. Mm, what do we got here? Orange Adolis Garcia Uncommon for the Rangers. Uh, for Richard. Incarnacion Strand rookie and Max Freed. Yeah, yeah, in um they do uh the they're called orange electric foil parallels. So they do like a paper and uh and they're they're uncommon. So there's common, uncommon, rare, super rare, blah 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 down the line. Ultra legendary Machado Riley Green. But the only way you can get the uncommon, I think, is in blaster boxes. Shohei and Marte, good vibrations, rookie. J.D. Martinez. Oscar Hernandez. Dolores Garcia to the moon. I had forgotten when I was watching baseball, you said, I forgot that Miggy retired last year. <laughs> it's all thing like it's the first opening day Detroit had in like 17 or 18 years without him on the field. It's crazy. You just don't hear, I mean, you hear all these crazy contracts these days, but 
Jason Dominguez rookie. You don't see a lot of guys that long with the same team, you know? Uh, Kutch. And Castillo. Baez. Ah, the swinging friar. <laughs> Our favorite of the Padres. Curtis Mead, rookie to the moon. And Gleiber. All right, so here's a question. Where is Creighton uh, University? I'm just seeing them on the game here with Tennessee. Is that like an Indiana school or Lindor good vibration? I have no idea where they are. Torkelson. All right. Nothing crazy there. All right. Box number five. Logger, Eloy. Your Omaha? It's in Nebraska? Really? Yeah. If you gave me 20 guesses, I don't think Nebraska would have been on that list. I had no idea that's where it was. Huh. They're one of those schools. Like, I don't follow college basketball like I used to when I was younger. I mean, I watch it here and there, but they're like one of the schools that's come on in recent years to be really good, right? I mean, kind of like Gonzaga has in the last, like, 15, 20 years. And I think I've heard their name a lot, but I don't know anything about them. Uh, Zach Geloff to the moon, rookie. A oh, good friend from high school went there? Okay. Henry Davis, become a big leaguer. Judge. Yandy Diaz. So again, guys, for anybody who wasn't here earlier, we do have a couple uh, big league breaks up on the website that are filling up, almost done. Uh, half case, 10 box, pick your team break. I think there's eight teams left over on Chef Sports Cards. If you want to check that out. And then we got a 20 box uh, blaster. Pick your team up over there also. <clears throat> we also have the lead extra. And uh, for those who checked out already, the price was wrong on it. When I don't know how. And the price, it, it came down in price. I don't know how I put that price on. but And anybody who already bought in, I refunded the difference to them. So um, there's like five or six people bought in so far. So uh, it is cheaper than what it was originally listed at. To go check those out. Uh, Evan Carter, Good Vibrations. Kirby. Yeah, it's funny. We were talking about the other day, Joe. I didn't either. And I was thinking the same thing. It's been years since I didn't. Uh, like I said, I don't really follow it like I used to. I used to love college basketball. It's funny. This sounds like a <laughs> like something you'd hear in a movie. College basketball was the thing my father and I like bonded over when I was a teenager. Like me and my father are really cool with each other now and have been for years. But when I was a kid, he worked all the time, and you know I was an ass for the most part. You know I was a teenager, and uh, but the one thing we loved was watching college basketball back in the day. I know if you, some of you guys remember back in like the '80s, they used to have these like triple headers on ESPN. And we'd watch anyone, you know, the big sky conference game at like 11 at night, like, you know, Boise playing Montana and stuff like that. 
So for years, I followed, followed it really closely. I just don't have the time to follow very closely now. Uh, Yoshida to the moon. And usually I still fill out a bracket because I'll have, you know, I'll know some of the teams, but honestly, this year I had no idea, so I didn't even bother. Another gunner. Shroman. I wonder if anybody's got a perfect bracket out there. <laughs> There's been some upsets this year, that's for sure. I don't know if it's as crazy as it's been in the past, but I don't think a lot of people probably thought NC State would make it this far. Jose Altuve, super rare. There we go for Houston. My man, Umberto. Nice one there, buddy. With the brackets, too, it's one of those things where, you know, everybody's got these, like, um... Yeah, win $250,000. Is that what I was like? Oh, well, what the hell? Might as well try. You never know. You might get lucky. <laughs> uh, Nolan Good Vibrations and Yuri Perez. Jason Dominguez to the moon, rookie. To the moon, Alice. Hmm, what do we got here? Kodai Senga from the Mets on the rare blue. Uh, Brandon. Kodai Senga. Slamming Sammy again. Lars. Uh, Gunner, good vibrations, and Castillo. Last few packs. Oh, wow, all of a sudden, my, uh, uh, Bryson's thought my equalizer's been funny the last few days. I don't know why. Just decides to not work all of a sudden for some reason. Uh, Clark for the Cubbies. Uh, last pack. Dominguez rookie and Jazz on the good of I operations. Riley Green. All righty. That will do it. I want to thank everyone for joining us this evening. As always, I couldn't do this without y'all, and I do truly appreciate it. Uh, if you're not in any of our other breaks tonight, please stay safe, stay healthy out there. We do have to do a quick random for the Become a Big Leaguer cards. So, give me a sec and we'll, uh, we'll get that set up. And then we'll do a hit recap and get out of here. All right, not quite as good as last night, but not too bad, especially with the Evan Carter. Last night was uh, particularly good. All right, bear with me one sec. Let me set up. I forgot to set up the uh, random.org earlier. So. All right, give me one sec. And 
Has to verify that I'm a human being. Rando. All right, so we're random for the Become a Big Leaguer cards. Top five teams will each get one. Uh, we're going to random five times. Let me get... Something to write down on. All right, here we go. Five times. Good luck, everybody. One, two, three, Four and lucky number five. Good luck, everyone. All righty. The Twins, Reds, Dodgers, Braves, and Mets. Beautiful, beautiful. All right, so Twins, Reds, Dodgers, Braves, and Mets all get a become a big leaguer card. All right, hit recap for uh, 2024 Tops Big League Quarter Case Break number two. So this is all just like random stuff I pulled out, rookies and stuff that's going to be uh, top-loaded. Uh, rookies of Dominguez, Marte, Encarnacion to the Moon. There's that Dominic Canzone orange rookie. Zach Geloff, Yamamoto, Dominguez again. Caminero, De La Cruz, De La Cruz again, De La Cruz again. Dominguez, Yamamoto, and then Kirschstadt, Wynn, Geloff, Mead. Dominguez, Dominguez, De La Cruz, Dominguez, <laughs> De La Cruz, Dominguez. A lot of De La Cruz and Dominguez. And then hits, we had the Uncommon Adoles Garcia Orange. Uh, blue Rares, we had Bellinger, Schwaba, Verlander, Bieber, and Senga. We had a Super Rare, Jose Altuve, David Bednar, base auto for the Pirates, and a very delicious Evan Carter rookie auto for the Rangers. All right, folks, again, if you're not in any other breaks tonight, please stay safe, stay healthy out there. We will be here tomorrow night, too, so come see us then. Otherwise, I will be back in about five minutes with Elite Extra Edition. Have a great night. Take care.